Single player selected. And welcome back friends, welcome back to the awesome Indiana Jones and the Fate of Atlantis. You join us, Indy, Sophia, Chip Pants and myself. Mm-hmm. In Crate. And don't forget the, the scary ghost man that she channels. Oh yeah, of course. <laughs> Let's have a look at this. It's just about the same size as the stone discs. Well, there's a clue if I ever heard one. Okay, so can we use the stone, sunstone on that? Um... Well, that didn't do anything. Okay, well that's whenever it was in darkness. Okay, hold on. Let's pick that back up. I think we need another disc for this one. Oh. Maybe the sunstone. So let's go exploring. Beautiful island, though. The world does feel kind of bigger than Monkey Island, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. The, I could get lost in it. Oh, she's stuck. Oh, she's stuck. Oh, well, she'll work it out eventually. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's, let's have a look in here, shall we? It's really good, though. The ga it's, it's getting really, really good for me. You can see how this game really captured the feel of being Indiana Jones, you know, in a point and click rather than some kind of action game. Definitely. I think it works better. It does. It's a pile of rubble. Okay, I don't think there's anything in this room. Because I know Indiana Jones was known for his action and whatnot, but I really love the stories. Only the penitent man will pass. Yeah, being an explorer and just finding things out, mm -hmm. finding mysteries. Using your knowledge and your learnings. Put together the pieces of history. Okay, so it's a instrument. surveyor's transit, useful for measuring angles and laying out straight lines. No, let's pinch it, shall we? Oh, actually, can we use it? No. Hmm. Can we pick it up? Okay, got a transit. Looks like we've got a lot to explore down here. I'm surprised this place hasn't been picked clean from grave robbers and such. I bet it has, but have they looked as deep as Indy's gonna look, Chip Pants? Oh, he knows where all the secrets he are. He does. Like Pugman with his loops. <laughs> See if we can go in here. It's a long walk. The, um... John Williams has done a, a wonderful job changing the music for, for each uh, location that it's we're at. It's a pile at. of rubble. Now, I wonder if he actually did that music. I reckon he's just done the uh, traditional With... Indiana Jones. Oh, I see. It's amazing it's lasted this long. Theme song. Still good. Can we use the ship rip on this? I don't think that'll work. Okay. See anything in here? Let's check this room out. Mm. Uh, and talk to the pots. Nothing in there except dust. All they're holding now is air. Okay. Don't see anything in here either. You know the thing that I would have been trying? Yeah. Is I would have been walking around with my fish and letting it point. <laughs> Where's it fishy? Where's the loot? <laughs> now this is something. Let's have a look at it. It's an ancient diagram of some kind. There's a bull's head, horns, and tail. The lines appear to converge on that circle. Could the circle be one of the stone discs? Hmm. Okay, so he's saying there's a bull's head right there. Yes. A bull's tail. Right there. Bull tail? 
converging on the horns of the bow. Yep. To where something might be. Okay, so you got that down, Chip Pants? You got it down, okay. All right. Let's have a look at these stones. It's a pile of rubble. Or is it? Can we push it? They won't move. More stones. It's a pile of rubble. Can we push it? They won't move. I know some of these stones you can shift. Now look at this thing, Chip Pets. So it looks like the town horns. centerpiece. Come on, Sophia. Put your back into it. We gotta drag these back. I'm sure there's something you do with these stones. It's a pile of rubble. Hmm, the stones look loose. Oh, this one's loose. Can we push this one? There's a statue here. Boom. So that's the head bull's head, chip pants. Bingo. Now we need to find the tail. <laughs> um, I, I would have stuck my hose in it. <laughs> You what? You stuck your ho hose in the bull statue. <laughs> to, no, to make well, a tail. To make okay. a tail. <laughs> no, there should be a... It's a pile of rubble. Oh, so it, that, that mural was like a map of this town. Yes. Oh, I'm with you. And these are the tall horns on it. I see. But we're looking for the other clues. Uh, somewhere south, I think, that uh, should be the tail, then. It's a pile of rubble. Hmm, the stones look loose. Mm -hmm. Ho, 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 ho. We'll give it a push. There's a statue here. And that's the tail. So, if we you Now, remember, if they cross the lines through the bull's horns, it will reveal the spot. Okay. We're so we're going to use the surveyor's transit. We're going to use the transit on the tail. Oh, this is neat. Okay, so... We're in first person, people. Let's have a little scan around. <laughs> Out of the way. <laughs> Everybody wave to Sophia. Hey, Sophia, move. <laughs> Now this is what we're looking for, Ooh. the these finger magics. Now, do I have to point it on this one maybe? I see the right horn. Okay. So we now need to do the same thing on the bull's head. Okay and see where the lines cross over. I'm glad you know how to use this transit pug, because I don't. <laughs> oh my God. This is a difficult one. This is a difficult puzzle. Hello. Uh, maybe on this horn, I guess? I see the left horn. Hello, what's this? Oh. Bingo, people. X marks the spot. Now, if you were just puttering around, could you have stumbled across this area on your own? You'd have to go through the procedure that I just went through. Okay. This is where the survey lines triangulated. Be nice if I gave you a shovel to randomly dig. Ooh, that would be neat. Okay, we can we dig with this ship rib? Hey, there's a stone disc down here. It's oh, got a man. hole in the middle and little moons carved into the surface. It must be one of the moonstones Plato wrote about. Bingo. Fantastic. Oh, don't forget your transit. Oh, can we pick that up? I don't think we need that anymore, Chipants. Pugman says pick up everything. Oh, fine. We picked <laughs> okay, up everything. Fine. I'm not going to lug that around anymore. Yeah, he doesn't want to lug it around. Chip fair Pants. enough, fair enough. Maybe we can give it to Sophia. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, so back to the original landing spot of Crete. Maybe yeah. we can stick the disc in there. This is where we're going to need your chip pants noggin. Mm. I'm ready. Your mm, doesn't sound very confident. No, no, I'm ready. I was just, I was just, <laughs> I was drinking my go-go juice. You, dr you drinking your whiskey, were you, chip pants? <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> I bet that really gets you speaking to spirits, doesn't it? <laughs> and puts hair on your chest. Is this the exit? There we go. It gets me speaking to them, but they don't speak back. <laughs> I know, sometimes, friends, you just can't beat a nice, peaceful point-and-click adventure game. This is what we needed on a, on a stressful day, I tell you what. Yeah, agreed. All right. We're going to use the two stones. Big Can one on first, both? of course, yes. Uh, okay. And then the old moonstone. See, this is Boom. where I would have failed. I would have just used the new one. Now, again, we've got the bull's head, and this time we've got a waxing moon. Okay, okay. Full moon. Full moon. Waning moon. Waning moon. And a new moon. New moon. That still didn't do anything. Okay, let's have a little read of old Plato's book. La di da. That many outposts a sunstone suffice, if darkness concealed the tall haunts. At the greater Connolly, a moonstone was also needed with pale dawn to shred the darkest night. There's the cloak. So before we had it, the darkness on the horns, right? Yes, the new moon on the horns. So let's do that. No, it was the... It was darkness, this one was on the horns, right? Yes, yep, yep, Maybe yep. Maybe I need to align the stones with each other and the tall horns, satisfying all of Plato's conditions at the same time. Thanks for that clue, Wendy. Uh, okay, that was it. Was that it? A pale dawn to shred the darkest night. Okay, so... What's a pale dawn? Okay, I'm going to say hmm. um, a waning moon. Now, a waning would mean weak, wouldn't it? I guess. Waning means weak. Okay. It's, it's the waxing is a stronger moon. Let's, all right, let's see what it does. Oh, chip oh, pants. Mate. What do you know? A secret door. You were born to be an Indiana Jones, chip pants. <laughs> I don't, do we do know oh, that oh, you're oh, oh, you what? Nobody told me to pick up the stones. I almost walked out of out my loop. Well, wait a second. Isn't it going to close the door again once you pick them up? There we oh, go. So, okay, okay. We almost left those behind. See, I would have done, uh, if I would have picked him up, I would have thought that it would have closed so the, the door. the legend of a labyrinth hidden under the ruins of Gnosis is true. The legend of Atlantis isn't any more far-fetched. Maybe it's true, too. I think the last stone disc and Atlantis are waiting for us somewhere beyond that door. Oh, now this bit. It's a labyrinth, people, so you're going to need to put the breadcrumbs out so I don't get lost. Okay, okay. Uh, so keep keep an idea of where I've been moving to. Nope, I get the fish out. <laughs> fish will tell us. It's a shelf for the busts. It's a bust of Ares. Sophia. Yes? Ooh, uh, ooh, you know what I'd do, Pug? What would you do? I'd, ta I'd take my knife and I'd cut off her hair and use that as breadcrumbs. As if she'd allow you to do that. Why not? Just a little bit of luck? Some date, huh? We're not dating, Jones. This is not a date. If it was a date, I would have stood you up. Yep, Aww. cut her hair. Cut her hair. <laughs> what do we do now? Let's see where this leads. Um, Follow me. Lead the way. Let's pick up the old statue head. <gasps> and this one. And this one. 
Okay, so that locks the door. Let's um, put one back. It's basically like a weighted lever. You need a bag of sand, Pug. Oh, yeah. You know your moves, chip pants. Mm hmm. Okay. They, they look like that they each weigh it differently. Like one looks bigger than the other. Didn't mean to do that. I think we're going to use our bullwhip and get sneaky. Stay away from the door. Oh, come on. Wow. He's pretty nifty with a whip, isn't he, Chip Pants? See, this is only the second time that we've used that bull whip in the game. And because the first time I think we used it on the hog or that 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 R U S. And uh I don't know if I would have figured that part out. Yeah. You might do later when you're just stumped for about I don't know, a month or two. <laughs> now pick a pick a path, Chip Pants. Where where should we go and keep track of us? Let's start left. Good idea. Ground floor first. Any clickies? It looks like a dead end. Okay. Okay. Okay, we came through there. Let's start uh, right. All the way right. Okay. What the heck is that? That's just water. It's too slippery to climb up here. Bubblegum. That's actually a fantastic idea, but we're not going to use that. We're going to go through this doorway. Uh, which white ship pants up here or level. left? Okay. Keep lower. I hope the people are remembering where I'm going. It's a dead end. Up here? Let's start going up then. Lowest levels all explored. Oh, Ooh, what's bones. this? Some bones. Bones of previous explorers, no doubt. They weren't penitent. Oh, leave me faith. Okay, is this a dead end? Looks like it. Looks like it, people. Can't pick up them bones? Don't want to pick up them bones? Don't want to touch them bones? I don't need any old bones. No, he doesn't want any old bones. Don't need no old bones. Okay, that's done. Let's go back. To the left, right? No, to the right. To the right? Oh, no, you're right. I am no good with directions. <laughs> I'm not bad with a bullwhip. But with directions, <laughs> I'm not too good. What's that hole? Anything to explore down there? Down the, where the water's going into? Okay. No. You know, I was a big fan of Indiana Jones people. I actually had a bullwhip as a kid. Yeah, the full cosplay costume, I, didn't you, though? Well, the hat seemed like some kind of Australian hat with, like, <laughs> corks hanging off it. But it was as close <laughs> as I got as a kid. Shit pants. Oh, that was funny. Um, Have we been in here? I don't think so. Left or right? Let's try left. I could go right, but we'll, we'll see what shit pants is sniffing out. Oh, so we can use the stone heads on this thing. Oh, that, that does look like a little weight. But there's loads of rooms we can go go here now. So we put the stones on here, or...? Put them up, put, put, well, no, let's do this area first. Let's walk you left. Sophia, don't come in here. Yeah, don't come in here. Why not? Oh, bugger. Never mind. Okay, so that loops us back around, so remember that, ship pants. Okay, going far, far left, loops around. Got it. Let's head back. Man, this is fun. I really feel like I'm Indiana Jones. Now, was it left? Try. Uh, yes, we walked left, but just take a look. Take a look right, just to see if okay. we can eliminate this room. Got more bones. More bones. Bones of previous explorers, no doubt. Okay, two rooms. Let's just Looks have a like look. Looks like another unlucky explorer. Which one you want, Pants? Far left. Ooh. Oh. Man, okay, it's, it's getting big here. I should be doing a map or something. Let's have a look at a statue. For all I know, it's the original Minotaur. I used to wonder why the Minoans were so obsessed with bullheaded figures. <laughs> Come to think of it, I still wonder. Okay, let's have a little peek left. 
We can come back to that statue in a minute. Okay, so that loops uh, back around. Be... Okay, so we did that far left room in here, did it? Now. <gasps> Wait! That looks different. Sophia. Yes? How much do you love me? Um, do you think we're lost? Who knows? I'm too lost to think. Follow me. Lead the way. Okay, now we are... It looks a bit wobbly. There's a clowed air paper. If there ever was a clow. Now what we're going to do, Chip Pants. Bull whip. Bull whip. Bull whip. Everybody stand back. Watch your toes. Get behind me, Sophia. All right. Ah. Sophia, get over here. Oh, what's going on, Indy? <laughs> It must be a primitive elevator of some sort. Need multiple people to activate it, though. Ooh. Oh, who's this fella? Unlucky sod. I always thought Mr. Otis invented the elevator. Yeah, well, this is our floor. Who is Otis? Mr. Otis. It's too heavy. I don't know who she's talking I about. I don't know, people. Oh, it's oh, Professor. That was our ride. Oh, bugger. But it's Professor Sternheart. You remember him, Chip Pants? He ran out with our thingy magic in a temple with the parrot. At the very beginning. The guy that froze? No. It's our old friend, Professor Sternheart. Looks like he's starved to death. How awful. I guess he knew a lot more than he let on. But not quite enough, apparently. Yeah, we'll starve too if we don't find a way out of here. Oh! The guy outside the Aztec temple. I know who you're talking about. Okay. Uh, yeah, the guy at the, the temple. He pinched he our thingamajig. He wouldn't let us take a crappy lantern. He yep. pinched our world stone, I think. Oh. It's the world stone that Sternhart swiped into Cal. Oh, swipe it back. He's got a note. It says, I am convinced the map room lies beyond the next chamber. Alas, I cannot get past the gate. I need that autocalcum detector. Too bad for Sternhart. He came a long way. Oh, we have the old cal what was it, old calcum detector. Uh-huh. Mr. Fishface. It's a walking staff. Okay. Can I pick him up? <laughs> I can't pick that up. Alright, that's up. <laughs> Alright, well. He said the thing was next door, right? Yes. He's convinced it's in the next chamber. Oh, there's an eye there or something. Oh, you see that? Chip Pants? Good eye. That is actually the logo for LucasArts. Oh, okay. Oh, I see, see that. It? Yep, yep, yep. I see it now. So I guess we've got to get this gate open. Oh, there's a hole. It's a narrow crawl space. Um, I don't think we can get up there. Too high to reach. she get up there? Yeah, toss her up. Hold up. Sophia? Yes? Um... Let me boost you through that hole. I'm not climbing through there. I'll bet it's full of spiders. Or rats. Or snakes. It's all slimy inside. <laughs> Do it now! <laughs> we are going to die. <laughs> Feel inside. <laughs> I love that scene where they shoot it, and it's just his fist, like, oh. and he's he's speaking through the fist. He's... Many a time I have to do that to chip pants. You are the right. Go. <laughs> uh, what's the matter? What's the matter? Scared of a few bugs? You don't fool me, Jones. You're the one who's scared of snakes. Uh, I am not. I am not. You are too. Am not. <laughs> are too. Yeah, this is just going to go into a kind of monkey island circle, I think. Okay, think what you want. Oh, you are so vain. Now, I do think we do need to get her up there, but 
I think there's another way out. Oh, through the oh, waterfall. Nice. Wait, there's a chain running up behind the waterfall. It must be holding the elevator's counterweight. Okay, can we use the chain? Uh, oh. <clears throat> ah, ouch. <laughs> I hate getting wet. All right, um, so there was... I'm looking for that place where we'd put the heads on the lever, Chip Pad, oh, yeah. remember? Yes, I do. Uh, Try where do you reckon in here? Try in there. Okay, no. no. It's down here, I guess. Yep. We were, I don't think we were far away from it. Try far lefty. Mm. You're not okay. sure, are you? Oh, well, there you go, Chip Pants. Okay. Well done. Got, got lucky there. Now, is, this actually might be the complete exit out. I can't remember, to be honest. Are we just looking for the exit now that we've got our stone? Yes. Oh, okay. We want to get out of it. Imagine if you had only grabbed your two stones walking around this like oh we need more weight what weight do i need you need to bull whip the original statue is this the beginning i can't remember i have no clue mm. yeah the, it's kind of looping back around i think i'd be pointing the bones <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that's different. It's a shaft plunging into the darkness. Oh, I, I remember this bit. I can't on. reach it. Gold box. It's like a weight. Yes, we need to... It's a wedge that keeps the counterweight from sinking. We need to mess this up. We're going to use the stick. If I remember right. There, the counterweight is free. Does that do anything now? I don't think that'll work. Hmm. We need to get across there, and this kind of lowers it. Let's keep exploring. See, there's something that I was a little confused about. Yeah. He said that he was convinced, um, I can't remember what he said, was beyond into the next chamber, but he needed the um, detector to find it. Now, we have a detector, but it's like, but we're already on our way out? Ooh. There's a detector. It's not pointing pass. anywhere. There must not be any aura calcum nearby. Okay. Okay, that will come into play later. Ooh. There's a small cleft here. There's a small cleft here. Now... What do we want to stick in there? It's an ancient wooden peg of some we sort. We tried a wooden peg. I don't think that'll work. Alright, I don't think there's anything we can do here at the moment. But if you can remember where this room is... It's a shaft rising into the darkness. It does look like the counterweight would come down here. Okay, to the right of Lucas Arts is that room. Got it. There, did we go up here? Hmm. Do I have to do anything else with this room? So we want to get to that golden box. There's a bull at the top left. Does that mean anything? A bull's head? It doesn't highlight up. It's pointing at that gold box. <laughs> okay. That's a dead end. Right, maybe we head back to Sophia and see if we can get her up that hole. Now, 
Yeah, I'm totally lost. Uh, so the left sends us back down, doesn't it? It slips down the thing. Uh -huh. But maybe we want to go back down there and loop back around. Oh no, we can go down here. Here we go. Here I go again. Oh, you don't need extra weight, okay. And there it goes again. The game's really done well, I think. Yeah, you don't get many much better point and click adventure games than this. Now, where is she? Oh, there she is. <laughs> Excuse me? Huh. Now no. you gotta go up there? Yeah, what's the matter with you? What's the matter with you? Nothing. Go find a pit and jump in, will you? Excuse me? Huh. I'm sorry I was rude. Was I rude? You're just trying to get on my good side, but I forgive you anyway. Nope. Just say it anyways. Uh, yeah. Come on, climb onto my shoulders. I'd rather not. Um, Tell her we're rot gonna rot down here. Tell her we're gonna die. Fine, we'll rot down here like Sternhardt. I'm not worried, you'll think of something. I just did. Get on my shoulders. Sophia. Yes. Oh, chip pants. I think if you were down here with a, you, you, you guys wouldn't get Come very on, far. Come on, under my shoulders. You I got a charm, chip pants. Do you not know anything about women? <sighs> okay, fine. Let me get on her shoulders, and I'll go through. <laughs> Trust me, that's not beyond me. I would do that. Um... <laughs> What's the matter? Scared of a few bugs? You don't fool me, Jones. You're the one who's scared of snakes. Uh, what if I am? So what? So what if I am? So you admit it. Ah, oh, we're really not going anywhere until I crawl through there, are we? Ah. Uh... Afraid not. Okay, boost me up. All right, so just Watch admitting hands, that Buster. you were scared activated that one. <laughs> There's a pulley on this side. We'll use it. Okay, hang on. Happy? We're not out of the woods yet, but nice going. Alright, let's get out of here. Now, where should we go, Chip Pants? I'm basically blagging it. So, so, are, um, are we going back to that pulley system? Um, why not? Any, anywhere, to be honest. Think, okay, let's go back. This is a dead end, by the looks yeah. of things. Let's try up here. We came from there. I'm wondering if our weight on the other thing will knock it down. That mm. lifty thing. Okay. Yeah, go right, go right. Lucas, Lucas says go right. We go right again. And then there's some bones that are going to tell you to go right too. Oh. oh. Okay. Oh, we can walk through it. Oh. Fair enough. Maybe the lower. Okay, that's where we came in. Oh, that is where we came in. Okay, we can't get back up there unless she can go up the chain. No, I don't think she will. Um... We'll find our way back. Let's go up to the next floor. I think that's where we just went. We probably have to go through that lower door back there. That is where, we, yeah, we just came from here, didn't we? Mm-hmm. I think so. We can cross over here. There's nothing hidden. we go up again. I think that's where we Is went. it just looping around? Yeah, if it does, if it looks familiar, we're going to that lower door to the left. Yeah, go go back. And let's go, yeah, to the left. But that's the beginning. 
Okay, there's something we're not trying here. So de we know that left's a dead end. Let's go this direction. Hold on. So this just loops around. I don't I think know. I can cross this. Uh, not that way. Okay, so this just loops around then. That's probably the thing I climbed up before. You know, f through the fountain. No, it was a, uh, where the the elevator was, where we climbed up. Unless there was two mm. climbies, I, I think. Can we walk to the right? Like, far right? No, what was that? I think that's... Seems like a dead end. Um... So that's the chain that we climbed up, isn't it? Yeah, right here. Uh, let's talk to her. Uh, Sophia. Yes? What do we do now? Let's keep looking for a way out of here. Fine, not very helpful. Follow me. Lead the way. Is this fish going to do anything? It's pointing at Sophia's necklace. Hmm. Listen. Yes? Okay, that didn't open follow up me. any new dialogues. Lead the way. Will she follow me up here? We'll see. Wait here. Ugh. Ah, ouch. Okay, so this is a different area. Brr, that water's cold. But if I tread on that, it'll bring me back down again. That's right. So I can only go to the right. There must be something I'm not doing somewhere. Okay, so only one option back there. That's the right. Left will make you fall down. Do oh, I want to fall down, though? Oh, actually, no, that's not a fall down. That room's not a fall down. See, that room's lowered. I have a feeling I'm going to have to use this fish or something. Can we use it here? It's not pointing anywhere. Maybe this will give us a clue. How to get to the gold box. Yeah, or... It'll kick off in a certain room. It's not pointing anywhere. I can barely remember this part, friends. Um, let's try to fish again. It's not pointing anywhere. We'll find it. Us, us and the fish and the people, <laughs> we're all going to find it. Yeah, Papa, and you just got to do this and that. Yeah, I'm sure some people are screaming, but... As they're stuffing their face with popcorn. <laughs> It's not pointing anywhere. Remember, friends, if you're screaming, I do have a bullwhip. <laughs> okay, far left, maybe. It's not pointing anywhere. Because we just came from up above. Is there a sign next to that door? Okay. I don't think so. It's not pointing anywhere. It's a dead end. It looks like it, doesn't it? Hmm. And we already went far right, didn't we? Oh, I think we've been everywhere. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, we've been that way, haven't we? I'm sure we have. Now I'm wondering, how do I get to that place where I saw the box? Yeah, the living. You know? No, I know what you mean. I'm just trying to remember. So nothing's nothing's in that hole. It's not pointing anywhere. I don't think that'll work. And that's where we just came from. Our... back. Okay, mm. far left will drop us to the original section. But we've been down there before, haven't we? You're right about that. That one takes us back down. Okay, so... What's through this door? Okay. This is going to be where the... There's the, where the thing image is. Okay. But we need... It's not pointing anywhere. To get that counterweight down here. I think we need both of us on this platform. Hmm. That's what I'm thinking. It will weigh it down, maybe? Because mm -hmm. I knocked a, a lever out below it. Got with it. the stick. Yeah. So can we get Sophia up here? It's not pointing anywhere. Hmm. So... Okay, we know it's through this main door. Let me check up here. And this has to be where the top of the counterweight is. Agreed, yep. yep. Mm -hmm. Maybe I need to do something more here. It's a shaft plunging into the darkness. You stick on... I don't think that'll work. I don't think there's anything else to do in here. That points at the uh, gold chest. It's pointing at that gold box. So where would we go with Sophia from here? We would go on the at the the thing, the elevator thing. At the very lower section of that room, that chamber. Oh, and it would raise us up. Or drop us down, I'm not sure. So go, check right one last time, I just because I want to see that room. This ah, is a platform. So that's what we would stand on, and it would raise us, uh, us and Sophia up. M maybe. Mm -hmm. Or we use this mouse. Um, oh, what about if we put a stick in the mouth? There we go. Oh. Going up? Going up. <laughs> you fed him. <laughs> I thought it was a breadstick. I thought we were going to stick one of one of the little beady things in his mouth. Oh. Oh, well. Unless we've got our gold box. Let's pick it up. You have your bag of sand, Pug. Watch out, watch out. There are two more beads underneath oh. it. I'll take them, too. Yeah, take them, Nindy. And anything else you see that may, uh, may tickle your fancy. All right, so we so have this everything. Is a dead here. end. Why it's pointing at me? Okay. It's pointing at your pocket. <laughs> Let's uh, look at this box. It's a gold box. Okay, open. It's an empty gold box with a lead lining. Hmm. Okay. All right, let's head back to Sophia. That thing is heavy in the pocket. Is she down here? 
think this is the only way I can go. No, we weren't sure how to get her out of that hole. Oh, unless we... No, we got... No, we, we just, um... We opened up the lift for her. You know? Not again. Now, which that way is it, hurts. Pants? I think it's left, isn't it? Yes, I don't think anything was in that hole. Is it up or left? It's up, Try isn't up, it? Up, up, up. I think it's up. Alright, and it's through there. That was through here, is it? I think it's Sophia in there. No, that's taking us back to... I think the beginning. Oh, down there. There we go. Okay. Going down. Okay, so now she can join us on this lift. Oh, uh, no, she can't. This just goes downwards, but... Why not? Because how about we take off the bull statue while she gets on it with us? It's too heavy, chip pants. Too heavy. Can't pick it up. Let's have a chat with her. In fact, let's get out of here first. Because I think we're going to use the gold box, if I remember rightly, with her. Oh. Like put her necklace in it or something? Yes, exactly. Oh, okay. So if we use the fish, why it's pointing at me? Which is pointing at the gold box, but it did point at her before. Uh, Sophia. Yes. Uh, yeah. Can I borrow that necklace? Can I borrow that necklace of yours for a while? Why? Um, I think it would look better on me. Um, <laughs> I think it's thrown off the orcalcum detector. Orcalcum. I think it's throwing off the orcalcum detector. So? So we need to hide it. So we need to hide it. You think so? Then say, Nurab Sal is a mighty oh king and his eyes see through. Say her junk, pug. Let's go. <laughs> Nurab Sal is a mighty king and his eyes see through. All right. I can't give you my necklace. Tell me your plan, and I'll try to help. Uh, I'm gonna put it in a gold box. For safety. I wanna drop it down a crack in the rocks. <laughs> I wanna put it in this gold box. Okay, give me the box, and I'll put it inside. Oh. Maybe you should give me your oracalcum, too. Sure there, but just for a few minutes. Thanks. Don't trust her. Don't trust her. Now let's see what the fish does. It's not pointing anywhere. Hmm. Let's try a different room, I guess. Hmm. It's pointing toward that blank wall in the back. <gasps> oh. Which blank wall? Oh, this wall. Seems to be crumbling a bit. You know what to do, friends. You see a crumbling wall? You poke it. With your little ship rib. As you would. Look! Look at this. Oh! It's an open passageway. <laughs> Let's get in there, Papo. Look, an oracalcum bead. This must have been the bead that attracted the orichalcum detector. Excellent. Great. Now take the gold box. I want to wear my necklace again. I guess that's an indicator that we've got all of our gold beads in here. They're just some more bones. How many do we have? Okay, we've got three. Now can we get out of here? <laughs> no. Excuse me. Door, move. <laughs> well, either Atlantis is a lot smaller than we thought, or we've found some kind of map or scale model. Laid out just as Plato described it in three concentric circles. How cool is that? That is neat. It's kind of like the uh, first movie as well. It's a heavy stone door. 
It's a heavy stone door. Okay, it looks like that first one is a, a waning moon. That's it's the a sun heavy in the stone middle. door. And then we've got... I'm not sure what that it's one is. It's a heavy is. stone door. Now we've got a spindle. Looks like it was made for the stone discs. Alright, now we've got three stone discs this time, so let's put them on. Put on the big one. Old medium bear. So if you were to put them on and in the wrong bear. order? If I you just were... don't think it would work. Okay. So you'd have to try again. So this time, let's look, well actually, let's have a look at it. So we've got the sun. There's different suns. We've got the moons. Now this one, we've got a city. Ah. West sea. East sea. And volcano. Okay, okay. Alright, so let's have a look at our Plato's book. See if we can work this one out. Okay. At the many outposts, a sunstone sufficed. If darkness concealed the tall horns, we got that one down. Done. At the greater Connolly, a moonstone was also needed with the power dawn to shred the darkest night. We got that one down. Got it. To approach Atlantis itself, a world stone was required as well, with the rising sun breaking night's grip above the fiery peak. Above the volcano. So the rising sun, yeah, I would say so. Rising sun above the volcano. Okay, so first we have to put the uh, horns at new moon. Okay, one second. It was darkness there, wasn't it? That's correct. And then was it waning? Yes, a waning. And then the volcano was under what? It pants. Under the sun. Which, under which the new, sun? Uh, rising, the rising, wasn't it? The rising sun. There, boom, right? Oh, yes. I think so. Spindle it, pug. Whoa. Oh, look, I've gone crazy. It's madness. <laughs> it's like a machine or something. Oof. I don't think these people were too primitive, Chip Pants. Don't forget your stones. Oh, uh -oh. excellent. I better not lose the stones. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the urge of Chip Pants. Okay, okay. Sophia, where are you? Ugh. That's not Sophia. We've got her, you foolish Americana. <laughs> Americana. Oh. Uh, which rock did you crawl out from under? Kerner, which rock did you crawl out from under? I have no time to trade insults. Hand over the stones or you'll never see Miss Hapgood again. Keep her. Now, I'm actually going to save it here, friends, because, unlike some LucasArts games, you can actually die in this. <sighs> um, so if we did... Over my dead body. You'll take the stones over my dead body. Don't tempt me. This is your only chance. Hand over the stones or I'll be forced to kill you. Uh, you're bluffing. You're bluffing. I never bluff. Oh. <laughs> Too bad. Some people just won't listen to reason. Now we have it, friends. With the stone discs in his possession, Kerner yeah. discovered Atlantis and drowned. <laughs> now that's quite unusual for a LucasArts game there to, um, to end kill, it. To yeah. yeah, so if you hadn't saved, well, you'd be peed off. <laughs> Luckily we did. Alright, so let's, uh, what should we do, Chip Pants? Take the stones, just don't hurt Sophia. Okay, take the stones, just don't hurt Sophia. She'll be perfectly safe in my custody. <laughs> oh, the Kerner, evil bugger. What a slimy toad. Mm. Uh oh, Kerner wedged it shut from the other side. I love that. It's so Indiana Jones movies that Indiana Jones does all the work and then the jerks come along to oh, reap the benefits. That is true, isn't it? Yeah. They look like Pac-Man plays when... Uh, <laughs> what? What? I'm completing the video game. But I won't, I won't say anymore. And I, do, I take my due credit. That's what you're going to say. These rocks look slightly loose. Poke it. 
poke it, chip it inside. Give it a poke, we'll give, give it a poke. A poke with the old ship rib. You know, I think one of the rocks is starting to move. Tell you what, that's a bloody handy tool. Crawling Hulk! You must board the U-boat. I'm not going anywhere. What have you done with Indy, you creep? Forget about Jones. How can you expect a man to lead you through Atlantis when he can't even find a way out of the labyrinth? And you're practically an Atlantis tour guide, I suppose? We have charted an underwater entrance to the lost city. <laughs> Together, we will discover its secrets. Anybody else Good distracted luck. by that box and fish? <laughs> you have a choice, Fraulein. Join us and fulfill your life's ambition. Or join your friend, another rotting corpse on the road to glory. Well, how can I refuse hospitality like that? Chance was a better man than I thought. If he could tolerate her. <laughs> I do like the hair flicks they do. He always does the hair Ooh. flick. <sighs> Hey, there's a Nazi U-boat. Oh, friends, we're going to leave it there for now. Mm. But you know in the next episode we're getting on that Nazi U-boat. That's our transport out of here. So I guess you better grab your scuba gear. <laughs> Chip pants, grab your rubber ducky. Uh, I've got my box and fish. <laughs> we'll see you on the next video, friends. Until then. Until then, friends. See you in a bit. Save and quit.